Hey guys, this is Mark with DisasterZone.us, aka Mr. Hurricane Tracker. Today is June 5th, 2014. Current time is 1.25 p.m. Central Daylight Time. I'm tracking a storm here out near the southern area of Campeche, and I'm going to continue to watch it over the next few days because the National Hurricane Center does believe this storm could be uh, our next tropical depression, maybe in the Gulf. But let's take a look at it. First things first, for those of you who are not familiar with the site, it's live directly from the National Hurricane Center. The only thing that's not live is the video, of course. So the first things first, we see the Atlantic map and the Eastern Pacific map directly from the National Hurricane Center. And down below, you see the live feeds. So if my text is not updated here, you'll see the live feeds. And more than likely during uh, the hurricane season, I will be working and then some of the live feeds will be more uh, to your discretion to go take a look at them. But right now, I do have it updated, and it says disorganized showers and thunderstorms continue near a stationary low pressure over the southern bay of Campeche. Despite strong upper level winds, some development of the system is possible over the next day or two. While the lows drift generally northward near eastern Mexico, the disturbance will continue to produce extremely heavy rains along with life-threatening flash floods and mudslides over portions of southern Mexico during the next few days. Formation of this storm system is right now at 30%. The next five days, we've got a medium to high chance of this storm becoming a tropical depression. Where it heads next is something you want to keep a watch on with me here on the website. So let's take a look at the radar real quick. Again, you see the best radars down below for the tracking. I'll put more radars as we go on, but these are the best radars that we use for tracking for the United States. Uh, the Atlantic, the Eastern Pacific, uh, the Gulf of Mexico, everything that we need to see is here. So the storm system here is actually uh, getting a little better organized, but once it gets further out into water, which I'm not sure if it will or not, this is one of the most strangest storms that I've seen uh, on how it's developing and how it's redeveloping. So it's kind of interesting to see the formation of the storm. Let's keep watch on it together over the next five days and I'll continue to keep you posted with the latest information and your daily tropical updates. Once again, folks, thanks for watching. Stay alert, be cool, and have a nice day.